Welcome to today's video from the River Tavy. So today I'm kayaking and I keep cycling past here, walking past here and it looks really intriguing so I really want to check it out. Should be some like nice woodlands up above. So I've started from Cot Hill heading along towards Cowstock on the Tamar. So coming into view up ahead is Cowstock and that is the train bridge. It looks amazing. So one side we have Cornwall and then this side we have Devon. Look at this gorgeous house. These people are so lucky that it's such a lovely house to live in. This place is just amazing. Oh my god, just in the funniest thing, they've got a crocodile. Someone who clearly has a sense of humour lives there. It sounds really silly, but I get really like stressed before I go kayaking because I think there's so much stuff to remember as in kit and planning with like tide times and stuff. And then I get here and I'm like, oh, it's, it's just so nice and so peaceful. <laughs> Total opposite to like the hour before I go. Look at this amazing house. Oh my goodness. This is different now, so we've got woodland both sides. So we've now passed the Cowstock and Cot Hill section of the river, and we're heading further up the Tamar towards more Wellham Quay and where there's a lot of mining and we can see our first mine stack. Over there, that's our first mining chimney. It's really, really nice here. It's so chill now. It's such a different vibe with just like more woodland either side of the river banks. And there's so many more ducks and different birds. It's lovely. All I can hear is Canadian geese one side and then some kind of bird of prey that side. So lovely.
pretty sure that these buildings that we can see, these derelicts, are part of New Quay, which is an old working quay, which is near to Gorton. is actually a train track. The train track was to bring the mining stuff down to the boats at the Keys. And you can actually get the train, I think sometimes from a place called Morwellum. It's really touristy, but they do this kind of like fake Victorian village thing. But you can actually get the train to New Quay. Um, I think they give all like the history and stuff. So that would actually be quite cool to go and do that one day. So round the corner coming into sight is Morwellum Quay. So I don't think kayaks are allowed to stop there, but then I also don't think it's open at the moment. So you probably could get away with it, but then I would check the website because you don't want to get told off. Anyway, this is my final stop before I'm going to turn around and head back. So I'm quite excited to see this. Behind me is Morwellum, which is the place where I'm now going to turn around and head back because I've got one more hour of high tide and that's what the Tamar Trails canoe people do. So I thought I'd just, you know, copy what they do, seeing as they're the experts and guide people. So now I'm going to head back. So hopefully my way back will be a little bit quicker and easier, even though I was going with the tide because it's a tidal estuary it's still somewhat hard going in places. I just can't believe how nice this is. It is so amazing. Next to me as I'm paddling along, I could get this blue, blue. I see this little fish going blue. <laughs> and then a little bloop is when they're landing. We're back at the amazing house. Let me show you again. I love that wall. I'm so sure loads of that is original. It's amazing. And look at that topiary garden. That's insane.
by this point I was so tired where I'd been paddling into a bit of a headwind and some stretches of the river you could feel the tide. Not only that, I was so tired because I hadn't paddled for such a long time. It must have been last year that I last went for a paddle and my shoulders were aching so much. So that's that, I'm back. I'm all packed up and ready to go home. So that took me about an hour to get to Morwellum and then about an hour and 20 minutes back. I couldn't believe it. So I like must have got it slightly wrong with the tide times and stuff. Um, Cause it, you, it looks like it's meant to be finished but it still looks like it's coming in so. Don't know, but I did tie times to Cot Hill and I also matched what the um, Tamar canoe people do. And so I would leave longer time and maybe go when the tide is a bit more in my favour. But anyway, I'm late, so I'm going to go. Bye!